Hi everyone, it's Jen Sheffer, and in this training tutorial, we are looking at how to use Split View on our new MacBook Airs. So you can see here, I have a Google Meet tab open in Chrome, and I also have a Nearpod in Chrome. So if I wanted to split the screen, what I would do is I'm gonna grab hold of my Google Meet window, and I'm gonna drag up and out. So it becomes not just a separate tab, but now it's its own window. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna hover over this little green dot and I'm going to select tile window to the left of the screen. You can choose left or right, it's completely up to you. And then on the Nearpod side, I'm just gonna simply click on that window and now I have split screen. If I wanted Google Meet to take up more space, I can simply drag this vertical vertical bar to the left or the right, depending on which app I want to take up the most space. If I wanted to switch, I can just simply drag and drop. And when I'm ready to um, e exit split screen, I can just hover over that green button again, and it's going to exit. Now you may be saying, okay, now where did my Nearpod go? Well, if I swipe up with three fingers, you will notice here at the top, I have my mission control appears, which again, this is different than our Chromebooks, but you uh, will get used to this, gain comfort with it, and I think you'll really like the ability to um, pick and choose which windows you're working in and which desktops you have. But if you wanna go back to Nearpod, you can simply click on Nearpod. So again, that is a three finger swipe up and that will allow you to go back and forth between the two apps that you uh, were using during that Google Meet session. We will be bringing more advanced tutorials to you in the future, but uh, for now, that split screen initial process, hopefully you feel confident with that and will be able to do it the next time you meet with your students for online teaching. Please reach out to any member of the BPS EdTech team for additional support as you get to know your new MacBook Air. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.